So th this is our this is our autonomous car. It's a 2011 Cadillac SRX. Uh, if you look at it, it looks pretty much like a normal car. But uh, if you if you walk around, I can point out a, a few of the modifications that we've made to it. Uh, some of the modifications include things that you can't see, like like uh, drive-by-wire systems so that it can steer, brake, throttle, turn the turn signals on, things like that. Uh, and other things that you can see, which are, are some sensors that are mounted around the car. We need these to perceive the environment around the car so we know where other cars are, where pedestrians are, bicyclists, things like that. All right, this is his baby. I thought you were going to open up We do that with three main types of sensors. We have uh, laser sensors, they, they look like this. We have six of those distributed around the car. We have um, radar sensors, you can't see those, those are embedded in the bumpers. Uh, they're also distributed around the car. Uh, with lasers and radars, we can, we can detect obstacles. We know how far away they are, the shape of them, and, and also how fast they're moving. So we can track objects as they're moving around the car. I should be able to get out of it. Back there. Oh, yeah, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> If you look in, into the glass here, you can see uh, a couple cameras. We use cameras to detect things um, like lane markings, construction zone signs, uh, things like that. Uh, we also use cameras to classify those objects that we, that we um, are tracking. So we know, we know where they are, we know how fast they're moving, and in some cases we want to classify those. So we know if it's a pedestrian, we know if it's a bicyclist, um, we know if it's a vehicle, for example. Excellent. It's amazing. I uh, a couple of times I was uh, you know watching, but a lot less nervous than Roddy was the staff. Was, uh, <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> I think that was a comedy. I was yelling at the computer to do things, things that it did it without even a hitch.